Hi everyone, welcome back to Aphrodite Men and Neil Tarot. Thanks very much for joining our channel today. It is very much appreciated. Just going to be doing a reading for Scorpio. Please let me take what resonates and link the rest. Don't make the story fit if it's not your story. Sometimes I do say he or she. Sometimes the story might be vice versa. Okay. Um, all right. For those of you that have um, liked, shared and subscribed to the channel, thank you so much. And if you do like the video, please press it. Press the like button. Okay. All right, Scorpio. Scorpio, I feel like that you feel that life is at, at a bit of a standstill right now. You might be taking a break, okay? There seems to be some sort of battle um, that is going on in your in your um, head, Scorpio. Um, I'm not really sure what the battle is and I think that there is a person in your life that you feel that everything is always constantly at a standstill and you've been waiting a long time for divine justice to sort of like step in okay um I feel like if you're waiting on this person it will happen in divine timing okay right now Scorpio I think you need to focus on improving your health um, and focusing on on you okay because this battle that is going on in your in your mind is not really good for you okay i do feel that right now scorpio that you have everything you need to create um a dream life for yourself you need to listen to your intuition scorpio and um i do feel that for some of you if you are waiting on love to come in it is coming and it's coming in perfect timing too, okay? Um, there's going to be some sort of compromise that is going to happen here, Scorpio, between you and this person that um, you were thinking about, okay? Um, let's get you some more information. All right, Scorpio, yeah, we have justice, okay? I feel like things are going to balance out. You are mentally tied and trapped, or they are, okay? And you do have the, the high priestess coming in and the heavy burden, the release of a heavy burden. All right. Scorpio, you are coming in single. I think with all the confusion that is going on and the behaviour of this person, and even though I feel that this person loves you, even though I, I've, I've got the divine love card, mm -hmm. and uh, you are soulmates, you are soulmates and you are meant to be together, but um, the constant interruption of other people is really um, making you think to walk in a different direction and focus on your, on your success okay focus on work i feel like communication is coming in in the next seven to eight days where this person is going to travel to come and see you somebody is taking a leap of faith okay um you feel that this connection has been slow for this person to make you an offer and this person though wants to come forward and they want to communicate with you okay This person may have betrayed you in the past, okay? But at the same time, I have to look at it in different ways, okay? This person loves you, but I think you have no idea how much um, how much of a battle that this person seems to be going through, but they're trying to find their strength. They are trying to find their strength. Um, So it's making you kind of feel, Scorpio, that this person may be um, betraying you in some way. That's that's what you're feeling because of the inconsistency that happens with this person. But they are trying with you, Scorpio. They they do love you. It's just that they they're going through some sort of mental, um, you know, thing in their head where they're feeling mentally tied and trapped to something, and they seem to be going through some sort of repeated pattern in their life. But they're not. They're not looking at things as clearly and 
I do feel that this person wants to come forward and they want to speak up and they want to talk to you. They want to tell you what's going on in their life, okay? Because they really do want this connection, Scorpio, okay? Um, sometimes, Scorpio, because you're highly intuitive, it can play havoc with you. So you need to ground yourself. You need to ground yourself, okay? This person, you know, they made you feel left out in the cold, even though that they were your wish fulfillment. And I do feel that this person is ending something. They may be in another commitment, Scorpio, but they do want to offer you a commitment. They do want to put in the hard work and effort. They, they do want to bring clarity and success your way, okay? Um, this person feels that they can have everything that they want with you. And you feel that you, you know, you need a stronger level of commitment because I think you're tired, Scorpio. You're tired that, you know, you're going to bed alone. You, you know, although you're okay with being single because it gives you opportunity to just do things without um, being tied to anything. You, but you want to come home to something. And I feel like that you have all the tools that you need to have a great commitment with somebody. But is it going to be this person, Scorpio? Because I feel like that there's a soulmate coming in for you, somebody who's gonna give you equal give and take, somebody who it could be, you know, an Aries or a fire sign or a father figure that, that is coming in to give you this partnership. I do feel that this person is your soulmate. Um, it doesn't have to be a fire sign, it could be somebody that runs their own business, somebody who's in charge of something. Um, the emperor is a person that uh, is a no-nonsense person and that somebody's coming in to give you this great offer and heal the situation with you, Scorpio. You might be moving house also, Scorpio, because where you are, you feel like that things are a, a little bit, um, you know, it's like a waiting game where you are, you're just, you're there, um, you're there until something better comes along. I'm not going to say that much. Um, but you've got something coming in really fast, Scorpio, and this person does want to talk to you. They do want to bring balance into this situation, okay? I feel that, um, you know, this person may be juggling you and somebody else, and they're at a crossroad with their decision, and they've been struggling to make a head over heart decision for a long time, but they might be saving their money and they might be keeping secrets to themselves. But there's a victory here, Scorpio, and it is coming in as the King of Wands, somebody who is very passionate about you, somebody who loves you very much and wants this connection, okay? I do feel that this person may have to walk away from something even though that they had, they had um, hope in a situation. But, you know, this person has been saving their money and, um, you know, a tower moment, a change is coming in and this person is ready to reveal what they've been hiding from you, Scorpio, okay? I do feel that there, there was a time where you felt that this person was connecting with other people and they had choices and they may have left you out in the cold and they didn't communicate clearly, you know, to you and you were just left waiting all the time. Um, you know, and that kept you mentally tied and trapped. But if this person is mentally tied and trapped, they're releasing something because they've got the will of fortune, okay? But it's a bit of a nightmare for them to, to do what they have to do. But their emotions and their love is with you, Scorpio. And they were confused for a long period of time. But I feel like somebody wants a passionate new beginning and somebody who is willing to put in the hard work and effort now. I feel you and this person will move in together. Somebody's got some plans to travel, but, um, you know, I feel like that they're gonna pack, someone's packing their things and they're moving. This could be you, this could be them, but you're going towards the Ten of Cups, okay? We've got new love that is coming in and we've got growth, expansion and success in this, okay? This person doesn't stop thinking about you, Scorpio. They know that they hurt you in the past. They know that they hurt you in the past, okay? Um, you and this person share some good memories, but there's a key, a new opportunity. This section here is absolutely amazing for you, Scorpio. We've got new love coming in, happiness, success, um, a key to a new property, a contract, um, you know, memories of the past, the past person, someone who, 
who misjudged you in the past, I would say Scorpio, but they were waiting for their ships to come in and now they're ready to go towards their their wish fulfillment, okay? This person has been watching you for a while, Scorpio. They've been trying to work you out. They've been trying to work out, you know, what? why didn't I see this in Scorpio in the past, okay? Um, yeah, and I kind of feel like, you know, you and this person have been walking in a maze for a long, long time, okay? And I feel like that every time you, you were ready to connect with this person, somebody else came into the middle, but I feel like this person is now going to restore some balance with you, Scorpio, okay? For a lot of you, you don't want this. You want to walk away. You want, you want to find new love. You want to go in a different direction because you're afraid of this person repeating patterns with you. And although that you love them, Scorpio, you feel that you will always constantly be in your head whether this person is being truthful with you or not. But they are going to fight for you, Scorpio. They are going to change their, their ways for you, Scorpio, because they see what they can have with you, okay? They see that, that there is true love there. They see that they can have the family, the home, um, you know, and everything, stability with you, Scorpio, because you are coming in as quite stable, Scorpio. I mean, you are focusing on you and the things that, um, you know, you need to create and you need a partner that's going to support you, Scorpio, um, somebody who is going to be, um, you know, supportive to you in the things that you want to do in life because you're very supportive to, to others. And, um, you know, you, you need that person that, that backs you up. And it's not a financial backup for you, Scorpio. It's, it's a different kind of backup. You just, you know, and this is why you kind of like, you need somebody. See, Scorpios, um, they're, they're quite happy, like, doing their own thing and standing on their own two feet. You're, you're quite capable of looking after yourself, okay? But... Um, there's a point here where you want to come home to somebody. You want to just come home to somebody. You want somebody to share that bed with you. You want somebody to ask you, how was your day? You want somebody to be there, okay? Um, I'm feeling a sense of um, you're, you're creative and you're focused and, you're, and you're, uh, um, you do have everything that you um, need to create this dream life, but you need, you need somebody that has their hand on your back. And I do feel that there is somebody coming in, you know, somebody who does want forgiveness from you, Scorpio. You've got big happy changes and abundance that is coming away. You've got helpful people around you. You know, in the near future, I feel that if you remain positive and you take action, um, you can achieve whatever you want to achieve, Scorpio, okay? Um, you know, don't let anybody don't let anybody tell you that you can't. And you've got somebody here that doesn't want to let go of you. They want the opportunity with you. I feel like this person is just waiting for a sign and they're being going, they're going through something bigger than what you know, Scorpio. But when, once they go through this recovery period, the situation is going to improve and romance will start to flow again. But this person is going to be uh, assertive and but they're going to communicate very clearly to you, Scorpio, what is going on, okay? And so within the next few months, it's coming in, there's no need for you to worry, okay? And um, I feel like this person is going to choose a new direction, okay? They're asking for help from others, um, you know. So I feel like something begins with the, within the next few months for you, Scorpio, but I also feel one year from now, everything is gonna be different, but the biggest message I've got for you, Scorpio, is trust. Trust that this is going to work out. Trust that this person will be faithful to you, okay? Just trust it, Scorpio. I wish you all the best and thanks for watching. And if you do like the video, please press the like button and Thank you so much and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.